Hey, it's me, Nick. I'm your Sunday school teacher this week. In today's video, we're going to learn about knowing God's voice. Now, how many of you have a little voice inside your head? Sometimes it tells you to be careful. Don't bring water by the computer. And other times, it eggs you on. Nah, it'll be fine. It can be pretty hard to tell which voice to listen to. Well, the same is true with God. God speaks to us in the Bible and through other Christians, and sometimes God even speaks directly to our hearts. But if you don't know God well enough, it can be pretty tough to know whether what you're hearing is God or just your own thoughts. Hmm. That reminds me of a time many years ago. Ooh. What was that? I heard a bang. I think there might be a robber in the house. Oh no. Mom! Mom! Mom? What's the matter, honey? I heard a noise. I think there's a robber in the house. What? What do you mean? Oh! Oh, that noise. Oh, sweetie, that's just the newspaper guy. He just threw it at the door and it made a noise. Okay. You don't need to be worried. Thanks, Mom. Go back to sleep. Oh, Love you. When I heard that loud bump at four in the morning, I thought somebody had broken into our house. I was scared. But that's only because I wasn't familiar with that sound. My mom knew exactly what it was. And that can be true of when we hear God's voice too. Sometimes when God speaks to us, it sounds something strange or uncomfortable or even a little scary. But you know what? The more we know God, the more we can tell his voice and his desire for our lives. Let's tune in now to the lesson video and learn a little bit more about God. 